G'day YouTube. So as it quite often does, curiosity's got the better of me. And uh, I want to have a look inside this 20 amp, 12 volt, 24 volt solar charge controller. It is a, uh, known as a PWM, pulse width modulation charge controller. A couple of USB ports in it and there's all its connections there. So let's flip it over and uh, see what we can see inside. Straight away, I can see an issue with this. The uh, couple of FETs there. It's got thermal pads on. That are meant to connect back to this um, aluminium backing plate. Let's just see if we've got something we can. Uh, touch between the surfaces and see if they actually uh, are meeting because I don't think they are. I would have thought it would be like partially sticky or something if they were. There's the texture would do it. Yes, I don't think that's actually touching. We'll rectify that before we put it back together. Because uh, obviously it's there to dissipate the heat from uh, those couple of little fets in the back. I'm assuming they do a fair bit of work, seeing as it can handle up to 20 amps. So in its current form, straight out of the box, I'm going to say that it probably can't handle 20 amps. If they've got that kind of thing going on in there. Right, next level of screws should get us the main board out by the looks of things. Yep, whole board comes out. That's what the whole board looks like. As you can see, the LCD stood up out of the way nice and high. And a couple of USB sockets. Um, it's definitely not as much on it as I thought there was going to be. Some pretty. Oh, yeah, there. Disgraceful solder joints. On the board here. It's better. There's big blobs chilling in no man's land there. And there's a pretty big uh, bridge made up out of uh, solder on the backside here. A lot of extra holes in the board. So we're obviously. Uh, or obviously gets used for multiple uses, but uh, it's a bit odd. I can't understand why they put these thermal pads on rather than uh, just a nice big dollop of the uh, thermal paste onto that back casing because that'll really dissipate the heat better. But uh, yeah, we can't read minds, I guess. The uh, the board itself seems alright, but. Um, yeah, that's, that's what's inside a uh, 20 amp cheap eBay PWM module. There's nothing overly exciting, there's no fuses. Uh, 
a little bit of shit on the board there, so it's a little bit corroded and mm. fairly cheaply made, lots of tiny little resistors in there. There you go. If you're looking at them on eBay, this is what my one looks like. Fairly generic build I'd say. There's lots of them on there. Thanks for watching guys. Thanks for subscribing. Um, I appreciate all the uh, new subscribers. If you've uh, just found me and you uh, aren't subscribed, if you feel like it, take the time to hit that subscribe button and uh, you'll see a lot more videos like this. Thanks for watching guys. Catch you on the next one.